Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jojo and if you're new here, it's so good to have you here. So some time back I did a thrift haul video and there were some pieces that I got from Gikomba. And uh, some people were interested to know where exactly in Gikomba I do go to shop. So I thought I'll take you along with me as I go thrifting in Gikomba. So let's get into it. You will board a matatu at the junction of Luthuli Avenue and Mfangano Street. And they usually charge 50 shillings to Gikomba. So the first place I'll show you is where they sell sufurias, cooking pans, and the metallic stuff. So after you alight from the vehicle, you're going to turn right and you're going to walk for less than 50 meters. So be on the lookout for people who are selling hats because right next to them is the path that you use that leads you to where the sufurias are being sold. So the prices of the trays range from 100 shillings to 500 bob and uh, this is dependent on the weight of the tray and the size. So you can put your tissues in and then display them in your toilet. There are so many candle holders, some in brass, silver, some are light, some are heavy. Yeah, a wide variety. The second place I'm going to show you is where they sell knickknacks, kids toys 
and if you love crafting they do sell craft materials so after you alight from your vehicle you're going to turn left and then after a few meters you're going to take the tarmac road on your right and then from here just watch how i'm going There are so many high quality cooking spoons and serving spoons that you can choose from. If you're looking for party supplies, you can get napkins, very unique ones. You can get um, glasses, plastic glasses. You can get even uh, plastic spoons and knives. Yeah, so you have a variety to choose from. So if you're looking for watches, bangles, necklaces, even earrings, you can find lots and lots of them here. And one thing is you don't have to use something for its intended purpose. For instance, I bought a bangle that I I bought a bangle sometime back from this place and I used it as a holder for my plate. I'll show you so that you get an idea of what I'm talking about. I found these cute plate deco holders or even frame holders. The earrings were brand new and they were between 100 and 200 bob.
so the last place is uh, where you can get your forks your knives your spoons yes and the best part is they do sell antiquish kind of stuff if you know what i mean so if you're looking for spoons and knives and forks that are not common and have that antiquish kind of look this is the place where you're supposed to be and the best part is the fox spoons and the small knives they sell at 30 bob and then the large knives is 50 shillings and then other stuff you can get for a hundred bob how good is that Thank you so much guys for watching today's episode let me know your thoughts down in the comment section below if you do love thrifting and if there's any piece that you've seen that you'd have loved to have i'll do a haul of what i got i wanted to do a haul in this video but when editing the video was too long already so i thought i'll just do a separate video and show you some of the stuff that i did get from Gikombam. So if you did like the video, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and if you're new, kindly hit the subscribe button below. And remember to turn on the bell notification so that you're notified every time I post a new video. So until next time, bye!